Hello and welcome to another episode of Warcraft 3 The Reign of Chaos. We're playing the Or campaign, The Invasion of Kalimdor, on the hard difficulty. Chapter 7 The Oracle. 20 minutes later, inside the caverns of Stone Talon Peak. The path cuts off in different directions. Hmm. Either of those caverns could stretch for miles. Perhaps we should split up. Very well. Be careful, young one. There's no telling what ancient creatures lie within the mountain's depths. I will care. So we're here with Thrall. Now I'm gonna be completely honest. Um, this is a voiceover recording. I recorded the whole episode normally, and my voice audio got completely screwed up. I'm just going to re-record some of the audio for some of the points I'm going to make, but for the most part I'm going to be pretty quiet, so I apologize for that. This is going to be a more silent episode. But we are, gonna, we are given a lot of different um, pots and a lot of different potions and scrolls, so we're going to be very liberal with using them. We're going to be pretty gung-ho with Frawl and his little group right here, and we're going to try to destroy everything. We're also going to be looking for all the different... Uh, all, all the different items that are around here. There are some really good items on this mission. We really want to kit out both Thrall and uh, Karen. We we'll get to control later. I'm just being careful, just trying to not lose everything, using chain lightning and uh, summoning wolves a lot. So while we're waiting, I'm just going to go grab the other consumables so we can use them. And then just send the wolves somewhere else, you know, just let them fight and die. And I may as well use things when I get them. We got some scouting information with the wolves right there. And that's the little gate there where we'll bring Thrall through. I think there's... Well, I know there's an item right there. <laughs> I 
The ring of regen is fine. Like, it's not the best item in the world, but we will put it on Thrall right now. It'll be useful. And of course, the wolves are blocking me, and they're slowed. Super nice. And one of these uh, chests here has a ghost. So I'm going to destroy the other ones, wait for Thrall to arrive. And there we got the, well, the Wraith, as it's actually called. We got ourselves a little tome of agility. Very nice. This is a pretty strong boss. It can shoot out Death Coil, which is quite dangerous. You want to put down a ward to heal everything. Just try to be careful with our units. Um, if they fall, it's not the end of the world, but every single unit lost is a pretty drastic loss. Uh, I'm going to pick up the Orb of Fire, I think. I'm going to switch out the Ring of Regen for the Orb of Fire. And if we go up here, we're going to find ourselves a little Tome of Intelligence. Very nice. Extra damage. Always good. Just keep cycling different items. Yes. We're going to use them. Next episode is quite difficult, or next mission is quite difficult, so we want to be a bit careful what we have. Yes, War Chief. Look, regard, look out. Yeah, I lost the raider there. That's unfortunate. That was bad control on my part. I should have slapped down the ward a bit quicker. Yeah, the door there is unlocked, so we're going to be getting ourselves a key real soon. Keep fighting. Destroying the rocks and all that stuff to see if there's anything there. There's unfortunately nothing, but you know, good to check. Like, it's not that difficult of a mission, to be honest. This one, it's 
Yeah. It's funny, it's actually a mission I had a lot of trouble with as a kid, where, uh, you know, I just kept, I, I just wasn't that good at the game, so I, I kept losing here. <laughs> We got the salamanders. Yeah, the salamander can bloodlust itself, which is, you know, kind of cool. Gonna use the potion, pick up the blood key. Maybe a bit of a waste, but oh well. So we still don't have enough mana for the witch doctor, but. actually quite a few items back here so I'm gonna drop a bunch of them in the throne room I'll pick up the other items use the consumables that I want to use and then pick up what I want in the long run Popping the scroll protection may be a bit unnecessary, but oh well. No reason to be stingy. We got some humans right here. Got ourselves some more headhunters. Very nice. I am. Let's get on. And only now do I uh, control group my units in the second control group. Healing up, good to do. For honor, none survive. Yes. 
for Doomhammer. Dumb. Hmm. We're gonna attack these sheep right here. I don't recall seeing any sheep in this land. <laughs> He's fairly bright for an orc. Defend yourselves! That's pretty derogatory by the sources right there. And as you can see, the uh, footmen are bugged. They're neutral. <laughs> this is like an old bug from back in the day, I believe. And it's still going. Kind of insane that they haven't patched that all these years. Even with Reforge, they haven't patched that. Maybe it's fixed in the Reforge version. We'll have to see. Let's see if I can remember that when we actually get there. It's going to be a long time from now. But yeah, no. A lot of, a lot of glitches and a lot of bugs in this campaign. With the with the orc section at least. Yes. Look regard. Let's get on with it. The spirits are restless. Dabu. Hmm. Dabu. Yes. For honor. Hmm. Yes. Look Naruf! For honor. Hmm. None will survive. For honor. Look regard, no gun. Dabu, yes. I am the war chief. Hmm. Yeah. Those harpies have nearly killed that wretched creature. It looks as if they're after its treasure. Kill them all, and take what's left for ourselves. Look regard, great beast was protecting a magical amulet. I'd better go along with this. Very subtle with the magical amulet, right? It's not like it's the heart. We're gonna see if this rat drops anything. Sometimes the uh, different critters have amazing items. And unfortunately it does not. The spirits are restless. Let's get on with it. So we're gonna abandon the circlet. You know, it's not that great. For and grab the heart of Azure. Yes. That's her name. I, I don't remember. So we are going to have to add back and get that scroll of uh, reanimation, but we'll do that after we've triggered the uh, dialogue. Here is your heart, Ajun. Now, grant us passage to the Oracle. Their name was Ajun. I forgot about that. Yeah, we completed this. You can see there are three different quests. First one is done. Second one is to get across the bridge. And then the third one is uh, reach the Oracle. Final one. Apparently, this is some kind of spectral bridge. The enchanted gemstone that powers it is missing. With any luck, Cairn will find it for us. There we go. Cairn. Hello there, Cairn. Back in control of him. It's a pretty strong, chunky hero. And he has reincarnation, so we want the damage to be put on him. We have a lot of consumables as well. Attack! Earth Mother is near. We have this big beefy rock boy that we have to take care of. Now that he's down, we can actually summon a rock boy of our own. We're going to hold off on that for now. Let's get the hell out of here! No, not that way! Precisely. They are Zush, Amen. old bones Precisely. 
Yeah, down here. Some scrolls. May as well use that. Scroll protection that we're going to keep for now. But we'll we'll replace stuff with better things. There are some really good items that Karen is going to pick up. Like some really good ones. Gladly. Precisely. Precisely, Ishnu Pura. I've had it with skulking in these caves. There's a special unit or a special event we want to trigger when we go down here. Yeah, the hungry, hungry lizard. So he's going to go and eat up all these mushrooms for us. And uh, we're actually going to go do other stuff. Wait for him to eat the mushrooms in peace. There is a great item behind there. Well, a great item. There is a good item behind there that we want. So let him work, let him eat, and we'll be back with the item later. Looks as if they're protecting some kind of gemstone. We're actually not going to trigger the trap because the quill boar have an item that we don't want uh, them to die via the traps because they actually have a really good necklace that we won't care to have. We're just going to grab ourselves the healing wards. Don't really need them, but we'll use them. Precisely. Take heart, young one. Yeah, pop the mana potion. Head back to see if the uh, mushrooms have been cleared. Precisely. Gladly. And yeah, there are a lot of trees, so he is unfortunately not done. We're not going to wait for him. We're just going to go clear the uh, quill bore and we'll come back and actually get our item that we want. Immediately. Earth, let's get on here. Where you want me to go? The spirits are restless. Well, bones ache. Precisely. Gladly. Gladly. So down here, as you can see, there's actually a healing shrine. So... The healing wards, it's kind of weird that you're given them so late when the shrine is so close by. I guess if you don't know about the shrine somehow, then they can be useful. I don't know. Karen leveled up. You're gonna power up Shockwave. It's such a good ability. It's a really good ability. We're just going to bait these pigmen down. The ancient dead. Don't really look all that dead to me, but I will. Another shockwave. Come on out. Lots of damage. Big damage. And yeah, that brave there just five shot. Five enemies.
They're just managing the items. You're gonna leave the prey after vitality. It's not that great. Pick up the Lionhorn of Stormwind. Gives us a plus one devotion aura. Not bad. Would be better if it was like level two or level three, but beggars can't be choosers here. His old bones ache. And yeah, we're going to abandon the health stone in exchange for the, uh, the gem. Precisely. Gladly. Gemstone has an inscription on its base. Ah, this is the spirit stone of Stone Town Castle. If the legends are true, then this will activate the spirit bridge leads to the Oracle. This dropped a belt of giant strength, which is really good. As you can see, I'm looking over all my items to decide what I'm going to abandon. We're going to come back for it. It's a really good item, so I, I want it, basically. More damage, more HP, good stuff. Stand and fight statues are coming to life. Defend yourselves. So we're going to give Thrall the plus 12 uh, claws. We'll switch them out and give Karen the plus 8 instead. And I'm actually forgetting that Karen is going to lose the gem. So he's actually going to have another uh, inventory slot. I actually forgot about that. So I'm kind of stressing over what I should abandon as well <laughs> to get the belt. <laughs> but we're just going to lose the gem to the bridge. Give Thrall the plus 12, take the plus 8, and then take the... Belt of Giant Strength. Is revealed. Bridge built. Yeah. We're just gonna mosey on back down to get that belt. I mean, giving the higher damage items to Thrall the ranged hero is pretty smart. And we're gonna heal up the Braves. There is actually gonna not be any more combat. Uh, the mission ends once we cross the bridge, but you know. They are very stacked up, Karen especially. Very strong heroes right now. We are ready for the next mission. I am the watcher. Let's get on with it. Orcs. I knew that we were being followed. Defend yourselves. Stop! There will be no violence in this place. That voice. You're no oracle. You're the prophet. Very perceptive, son. I am the prophet, and now that I have lured you all here, I will tell you what destiny holds. What the hell is going on here? Thrall, this is Jaina Proudmoore, leader of the survivors of Mordor. Survivors? What are you talking about? The invasion of the Burning Legion has begun. Lordaeron has already fallen. And now the demons come to invade Kalimdor. Only together, united against the Shadow, will you be able to save this world from the flame. Unite with them? Are you mad? Have you heard nothing that I've said? 
The Legion comes to undo history and end all life. Thrall, your friend Hellscream has already fallen under the demon's influence. Soon he and your whole race will be lost forever. No. I'll die before I let that happen. Then you must rescue him immediately. He is the key to the destiny I promised you. However, you will need help. Wait, this is insane. You can't possibly expect me destiny to... Destiny is at hand, young sorceress. The time to choose has come. For the fate of all who live, humanity must join forces with the Horde. Alright, so that was the end of this mission. Second to last mission of this campaign. We did it in 30 minutes, which is a pretty good time in my opinion. So that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Join us next time where we continue with the campaign, the final episode of this campaign. And uh, if you're new here, consider subscribing. I upload content every day, Warcraft once a week, other games on the other days of the week. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Take care.